Hansard are official verbatim transcripts of what is said in the Legislative Assembly and in committees. The name comes from Thomas Curson Hansard, who in the 19th century began publishing the debates of the British House of Commons under the title Hansard's Parliamentary Debates. Hansard is often used by those seeking clarification on how a law came to be. It can also be used to determine possible intent behind legislation. For example, a minister may be asked by a member of the opposition to comment on the purpose and intent of a law during one of the legislature debate sessions. In 2017, Quickscribe began publishing select Hansard references throughout the Quickscribe legislation database. As Hansard is added, an H icon will become visible adjacent to the section or law being discussed. You need only click on the H icon adjacent to the section to view the Hansard snippet. There is also a main Hansard page located via the left navigation. This page will allow you to conduct keyword searches for Hansard by law. By providing select Hansard throughout the legislation database directly at the section level, we hope to make it easy for you to gain some insight on the possible statutory intent behind legislation. Let's have a closer look. I'm going to use the Forest Act as an example of how we've applied Hansard throughout the Quickscribe legislative database. So whenever you're in a law and you see a Hansard reference adjacent to the title from the table of contents, these Hansard references are in general reference to the law uh, itself and not necessarily to specific sections. So for example, new bill is introduced and there's some discussion on how the new bill will affect Forest Act in this case. So you can scroll through the various debates over the years and view them one at a time. I think even more useful are the Hansard references that are adjacent to the sections themselves. So in this case, section 8, there's a Hansard reference as indicated by the H icon. I'm going to select that. And right off the bat, you see there's a number of different debates over the years, different discussions on this specific section, which means probably that the section has been amended a number of times over the years. So the most recent discussion or debate is going to be highlighted as the default here in 2016. And the snippet itself, we've tried to focus in on the core of the discussion where there is some uh, debate over the intent or some clarification on the intent for that particular section of law. You'll note that you have an option to expand the discussion on this page itself for more context. Uh, but you also have an option to link to the full Hansard debate on the BC Legislative Assembly site itself and we encourage users to do that for more research. And most importantly we provide you with a link to the bill being discussed so you can have a direct reference to the piece of legislation being debated. Finally, I'll draw your attention to our main Hansard homepage which is accessible via the left navigation. The Hansard homepage will provide you with an ability to do keyword searches across all Hansard. You can sort these keyword searches by relevance, by law, and by date. This page also gives you an update on the progress of how we're adding Hansard throughout the Quickscribe legislative database. We hope to have all historical Hansard debates in place by the end of 2018.